mentioned AMD, but also Oracle, NVIDIA. You've chosen to strike these deals and partnerships with with companies that you collaborate with, but could also potentially compete with in, in, in certain areas. How do you decide, you know, when to collaborate versus when when not to, or how do you just think about? Um, we have decided that it is time to go make a very aggressive infrastructure bet. And we're like, I've never been more confident in the research roadmap in front of us and also the economic value that will come from using those models. But to make the bet at this scale, we kind of need the whole industry to, or a yeah. big chunk of the industry to support it. And this is like, you know, from the level of like electrons to model distribution and all the stuff in between, which is a lot. And so we're going to partner with a, a lot, of, a lot of people. Uh, you should expect like much more from us in the coming months. Actually, expand on that because when you talk about the scale, it does feel like in your mind, the the limit on it is unlimited. Like you would scale it as, as you know, I mean, as there's big like as you possibly some, could. There's totally a limit. Like there's some amount of global GDP. Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, and, you know, there's yes, some yes. fraction of it that is knowledge work and we don't do robots yet. Yes. But. But but the limits it, are out it there. It feels like the limits are very far from where we are today. Yeah. If we are right about, mm -hmm. so so, I shouldn't say from where we are. Like, if we are right that the model capability is going to go where we think it's going to go, then the economic value that sits there can can go very very far. 